Hello guys, and welcome back for some more Let's Play Paper Mario TTYD. In the last part, we defeated Magnus Von Grapple 2.0, got ourselves the last crystal star, and now we're going to be finding out about Bowser without Peach's story interrupting the good stuff. Well, we're here. Now where's that stupid partially sanctum? The crystal star is here, right? So they say, your putridness, and lo and behold, there it is behind you. Great! Uh, about time something worked out for old Bowser. In we go. You can't actually go over here. Just FYI. Hey there, Toodles. Yeah, I'd say I'd like to mount a large animal horn in my foyer to highlight my social status. Oh my goodness gracious, you have terribly fine horns, don't you? You great thing. What? What? That's disgusting! Get away from me, you psycho! You can't have my horns! That sounded suggestive as hell. Eee! Yep, sounds about right. Hello, there, Mr. Penguin. Yo, hello there, guy. Partially hates is nice on a warm afternoon, eh? What's that? You're a great and evil king, are you? Really? Yeah, you know, I think maybe you got a little too much sun, eh? Much sun? Maybe sun? I have no idea what I actually said. Oh, let's talk to Gold Bob. Oh, look, my heart trembles. This is a fountain. So elegant. This is art at its finest. So very observant as usual, my dear Gold Bob. Indeed, surely this is an artist's art. Yes, dear, one cannot measure its worth by coins. That is what makes art art. And yet, the filthy rich always seek to define art with their ill-gotten coins. Yes, they seek to buy it. Yet, how can one appraise what the eye cannot perceive? Whoa! I don't have a clue what you're talking about. You people scare me. Seriously! And if we talk to Bub... Wow, you're big, mister. What's your name? Evil King Extraordinaire, Business of Legend, or Koopa Koot. Why not just the Evil King Extraordinaire? <laughs> I am Bowser. Bowser, Evil King Extraordinaire. Y yee! If you tell him anything else, he doesn't get scared. See? Names matter, people. Let's go on into Poshy Heights and get that Crystal Star that Mario totally didn't get beforehand. It's locked, it won't budge. Darn it! The lock broke. Whoa, baby! Awesome! It opened! Talk about luck. I guess really, rage is really pasty these days. I have no idea what it said. It looked like rage is really pasty these days. But then again, my eyes are really bad at reading lately. Yeah! This is it, Haggy! This is finally it! <laughs> at last, I've got my mitts on a crystal star! Yeah! Impressive work, Lord Bowser! You're the absolute best star-getting guy! You there. I have you now, villains. You are common thieves, aren't you? No, aren't you? My eyes never deceive. What are you implying? I'm no little thief, I'm... The Shadow Thief? In case you don't get the reference, more Superstar Saga references. The Shadow Thief is Popple. Popple the Shadow Thief. It's a thief. Popple is the Shadow Thief. Whatever. It makes sense if you play the game. Anyways. Bowser the Shadow Thief. Not a thief. The best thief. I'll be taking this next. Actually, Bowser, you're a rookie. S see what it did there? <laughs> what? The Shadow Thief. I knew this had the scent of no more, no mere burglary. Ha! Huh. You've been hornswoggled, Shadow Thief. For that is a red herring. A fake. What? What? A fake? That's two fake crystal stars, Bowser. But look at that fancy to play display! The pedestal and everything! It's so posh! If it's a fake, then where's the real one, huh? If you must know, I gave it to the real one to Luigi. Oh ho ho! You got to be kidding me! You mean to tell me that Luigi beat me here? Ugh, those Mario Brothers are so annoying! Hmm, how bothersome. The fact that we keep being outmaneuvered is disturbing. But where in the world can Mario and his brother be heading? Where? Lord Bowser. Ah, Paragoomba, what are you so worked up over? Hmm? Tell me. Now reporting, sir, and, uh, ma'am, sir and ma'am, Mario's collected the seven crystal stars and headed for the thousand-year door. What? The Thousand Year Door? What in the heck is that? The Thousand Year Door? An unbelievably legendary treasure is behind that door. 
Yarg! They're not going there too. Immediately, I'm gonna ruin Mario. Poor Pennington was probably confused as hell. Will you now, Luigi? Well done, lad. Way to not fail yet. Of course, I want to save my game progress. What if I never wanted to do that? Ever not wanted to do that? Never wanted to do that? Yeah, I guess that still makes sense. Why not? But we finally made it out of the Exnot Fortress, or at least finished it. We've got all seven crystal stars. Corking. Now we can open. Corking? That is sounds really dirty. That just sounds super dirty. You bother, you dirty man. Now we can open the thousand year door. Oh, yes, but. We still don't know where Princess Peach is. Well, let's head back to Redport, eh, old boy? Perhaps Professor Frankly can help us all to find our dear Princess Peach. That's totally what I read. There's something really long that we're going to be doing in the next part. By the way, something that is going to consume the entire part. But I'll explain it when we get to it. In the meantime, we need to take that teleporter that we saw earlier. And leave the facility, because that's the only way out. And I believe the teleporter was on... Sub-level 2. If I am not to be mistaken. And I quite often am. And I think it was just off to the left somewhere. It probably has a green light over it. Everything else is locked. Right? Right? Either that or we have to talk to somebody first. Yep, I was afraid we'd have to go through this cutscene, but I guess we do. Can't just head straight over to the elevator. Man, gotta love that x not theme, though. I'm seriously still rocking out to that. It's just delightful. Delightful beyond belief. So, the only place we have left to explore completely is sub-level 4. Because there's one door that was locked beforehand. A door that we've gone through many, many times. And, well, it's unlocked now, so... Might as well go on through it. Where are we now, hmm? You are Mario, are you not? It is pleasant to meet you. I am the main computer of this fortress. I am tech. I must tell you something. That is why I brought you to this place. Princess P Peach... I am so sorry. Most of my data was er erased, and my main power unit was shut down. Now, running on backup power with only cached memory, trying to stay operational. M Mario, you know that Peach is not here, do you not? Please save Peach... Please, please, Princess Peaches, with Grotus in the Palace of Shadow, I had to tell you that. Ah, oh, man, I hate this channel. But, backup, power failing. Mario, use the teleporter room to get back to Rookport. Teleporter room is on sub-level 2 of the fortress. I will release the room lock. Peaches on the Palace of Shadows. In the Palace of Shadows, not on it. Silly Bobbery. Please hurry, there's barely enough power left to activate the teleporter. I will cease all AI functions to send power to the teleporter for you. But what will happen to you? When the power is all gone, I will cease to exist as an artificial consciousness. But if it will save Peach, I would gladly do this. Because until I met Peach, I knew nothing of love. Oh, Mario realizes you've been cheating with my woman. Do not worry about me. I'm just a computer. Just a machine. Mario, you must save Peach. I ask you, please, and tell her. Tell her black screen. And Peach is a ghost. Thank you for me. We will, Tech. So, hurry to the teleporter room now. Mario, save her. And the last, the last of tech. Tech system failure reported. Mario, we must save the princess for that tech fellow as well as ourselves. Oh, yeah. Yep, and everything went all red now. But the music still plays, so I can deal with that. I can still jam out all I want. 
Everything is so trippy in here now. And I want to go up to sub-level 2, please, because that is where the teleporter is. Off to the left. And we need to get back down to Roadport, because that's where the Fastenier door is, in case you couldn't tell already. Uh, I thought you only open up the door that with the teleport tech. That was confusing. I thought it was further to the left, but it tricked me. It wasn't very nice of you. Anyways, just hit the button, and let's use the teleporter for real this time. Peach, goodbye. Pretty sparkly lights. So pretty sparkly lights. Crockety! I say, old boy, did you just hear something? So the game's become self-aware. Anyways, we're back in Rogueport. Well, if it isn't Mario... Professor Frankly, what are you doing down here? Over here, son. You brought the Crystal Star back from the moon with you, didn't you? What? Talking to my good here. The Exonaut Fortress was on the moon. Ah, yes. So Princess Peach was there too, I assume. Assuredly, but the Exonaut boss took her and made for the Thousand Year Door. Aha! Just a bit ago, I smelled some rank air and went to the Thousand Year Door. I saw a suspicious fellow in a cape go through the door with Princess Peach. Pardon? What, what? Dear fellow, you led me to believe the door would open with all seven crystal stars. Believe me, I know, but I'm quite certain of it. I saw it with my own eyes. I have a very bad feeling about this. Very bad. Princess Peach is in danger. Time is very short. We must go to the Thousand Year Door and rescue the princess. I'll run ahead and meet you there. Don't dawdle. You must come immediately. Uh, about that, Professor Frankly. I know it's dire and all that, uh, but I got a side mission to do over here. And an email to check. I feel like strong bad. Well, we could head to the Thousand Year Door right now and enter the last area in the game, but there is something that I said I'd do beforehand, so we're gonna do it beforehand. And, I believe it's somewhere down here that we can access it. Uh, avoiding that Koopa Troll, of course. I think it's straight down through this pipe. Straight down through this pipe. Indeed it is! So, I know it's a short episode, but in the next part, we will go down through the Pit of a Hundred Trials, and that was a really choppy sentence, but we will finish the entire Pit of a Hundred Trials in the next part, so see you guys then.